What's up guys, it's Nick Nasty here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the wireframe hitchhiker build and this is one of the best if not the best hitchhiker build in the game so let's get right into it. For the ability tree I went to the right for level 1 which increases the amount of damage inflicted on a victim when snared by 13%. For level 2 I went to the middle and breaking free of traps is 28% more difficult for victims. And then for level 3 I went to the left and when a victim is snared the activated trap is highlighted to all family members. For the first perk, I'm using Wireframe, and you can traverse gaps 40% faster and crawl spaces 60% faster. And then for the second perk, I'm using Scout, and your movement speed is increased by 15%, but melee damage is reduced by 10%. And then for the third perk, I'm using Fired Up, and after running out of stamina, there's a 90% less delay before stamina starts regenerating again. And then for Grandpa's perk, I'm using Exterior Alarms, and this is the best Grandpa's a perk in the game in my opinion because when active all critical doors and gates are highlighted for five seconds if opened for the attributes you get 26 attribute points in total from the skill tree and i put all 26 attribute points into savagery because i want to do the most damage i can with this build and the reason why I didn't put any attribute points into Endurance is because I felt that 28 Endurance is already good as it is. And plus, if you're running out of stamina, all you have to do is walk for a second or two and Fired Up will activate, giving you all your stamina back. And you can also put 3 attribute points if you want into Blood Harvesting, so you can carry 100 blood. But you can always play around with the attribute points and see what works for you. This is the skill tree for this build, so be sure to pause the video to take a look at it. And keep in mind that the perk Scout is a random perk, so you're going to have to respect the skill tree until you get this perk. But other than that, let's jump right into some gameplay. Cuts the victims here. For me though, my favorite my favorite execution is definitely Cook's execution with the broomstick. The one from the execution pack. Damn, we even so nice. Here you go, Grandpa. Nah, name. I gotta, I gotta order the mask. I was looking at some websites, like the reviews and stuff like that, off stream. But it's coming down to two masks. I might have to buy. I might buy two. One Grandpa mask, and then another Leatherface one. And then if Chop Top ever gets released, I'll buy a Chop Top mask. I saw that on the website as well. It's too bad Grandpa ain't able. He was the best there ever was. Grandpa chopped him just a little trick. Please, let's get together. Pull them upstairs with me. <laughs> oh, she's so weak, Dad, Julie. I'm gonna drop down well at the pressure gate. Well, she's not. Julie dead. I mean, what do you think, name? About the mask, like which one? Should, which one do you think I should buy? 
Because all these websites, there's like a lot of Leatherface ones, so you know, from like the 2003 movie and all those movies, like the 2013 ECM 2. And they also sell a lot of Grandpa masks. Grandpa one, yeah. Like I said, I might get one grandpa and one and one other face. But definitely a grandpa one for sure, one hundred percent. We got the grandpa mask for the first one, like the nineteen seventy four movie, the original, and then they have it for TCM two. They did battery, by the way, side battery. Oh, for real? Oh. Oh yeah, they did it right here. Yeah. Definitely the sunny. Yeah, I, I was gonna, I was gonna make a poll name. I was gonna make a poll. I might move that trap then for the slaughterhouse because I have one at the door, the fighting door. But they already opened the side. The right name, I'll probably do the, the poll sometime this week. Coming up. Oh, they did do it. Nice. Yeah. They do it. Yeah, they did my trap. They're definitely in slaughterhouse. Yeah, I see the Connie in here. Drop it down the slaughterhouse wall. I'll put the trap here, actually. My guy's like twitching today. I don't know what's up, what's up with the game today for me. It's twitching all over the place. Yeah, I talked to some people on the Xbox app on my PC. Yeah, Wireframe, Unrelenting, and Scout. And I'm definitely gonna try that one out next. The Unrelenting. Oh, the Volvo, dude, I did not even hear it. I didn't even hear it. 
Might just go down there, to be honest. Looks like they're going to try to go for either battery or evolve. Go down here. Yep, right here. See, you see that? Like, it's just my guy's just like teleporting, like sometimes. It's weird. I think something's up with the servers today. You're near a generator right now. Right door. Okay, I gotta move my traps. Yes, if it was my internet, the stream would be lagging, though. That's the thing, so it's definitely not the internet. For me, it has to be the game. That's me one. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oh my gosh. A uh, name, by the way, my, my voice chat is actually working today. Got slaughter again. It's all good. Guys, see if the fuse is here. Yep, yep, I'm on my way. You got something good cooking up for us? I'm gonna put one at the the fuse, then the fuse and the gap over here. Sometimes I like to put the pellets by the gate too, over there. Oh, god damn it. I'm feeling grab 74 blood right now.
Get the exterior alarms, the most important. Just so I know if they're going into Slaughterhouse. Because I don't got a trap there this game. Got two traps near uh, the fuse right now. That guy wanted that trap right there. Yeah, I'm gonna chase her now. Oh, nice. This is the slaughterhouse. Got the honest, she's dead. I didn't put a trap there. Oh, you did? No, no, no. Should I move it then? Because I have one at the, the tool storage shed. I can move it if you want. Just let me know if you guys push her down, though. Oh, they just, they, dude, they're all the way down there. They're all the way down there. Okay, I'm, I'm coming, I'm coming. One way. Just go for the well, Connor. Yeah. I'm gonna put a trap there. Someone open that door, by the way, like the, the last one. To go outside. Yeah. Well, thank God put the pedal out by the gate, man. Definitely here, yeah, somewhere over there. Yeah, here's someone. Yeah, voice line sold them. The Connie's on me. Oh, almost got her with that door. Ah, she dropped down well. She dropped down. I say you stay there, dude. I can. I can chill over here. Just gotta let me know about your padlocks. Well, you didn't reach it. Both of the basement. Drink it now, Grandpa. Get your fear off. Said okay, both uh, basement. Yeah, oh, she she just opened the. I got her in my trap right now. Yeah. I shrub another wall. Still gonna keep this here. She stole the pedals by the gate key and he rage quit this. You gotta be kidding me. There's no way. Wait, what happened? You saw the padlock? Yeah, he saw the padlock in G2. Haha, <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. I'm sick of eating scraps. Oh, like he was, was he at the gate? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> then he saw the padlock. Yeah. Maybe I have to try that now, the padlock at the the gate. On the Kanye, on the Kanye. Yeah, just keep marking her for me. I'm gonna go down. On it right now. I'm chasing the Connie right now. 
Oh, she's dead. Got the Kami. Who's last one? The uh, the Julie, right? Yeah. She basement? Oh no, she's dead. Yes. As you saw from the gameplay, this is one of the best, if not the best, hit checker build in the game. And if you have any hit checker builds you want me to try out, please leave a comment down below and I'll definitely try them out for future videos. And also leave a comment down below and let me know what do you think about this build and what changes would you make to this build. But other than that, this was the wireframe hit checker build and I hope you guys enjoyed. So be sure to leave a like and subscribe and take care guys and have a good day.